It's Black Universal. Let's start off with some news. Will Smith and Jada Smith's company Just is donating bottles of water to Front Public Schools. If you don't know anything about this company, it was founded in 2015 by Will and Jada Smith. Will claims it was the kids' passion for the ocean that started this company. Just will donate 9,000 bottles of water to Front Public Schools monthly until the lead levels are acceptable. Moving on, South African Congress votes in favor to strip away white farm owners' land without compensation. New president of South Africa, Seville Ramfosa, said, We're going to address this and make sure that we come up with resolutions that resolve this once and for all. This original sin that was committed when our country was colonized must be resolved in a way that will take South Africa forward. This is some radical shit. On one side, two wrongs don't make a right, and on the other side, no sympathy at all. Shout out to Jordan Peele for winning his Oscar for Get Out. And shout out to SZA for going platinum for her second album, Control. Let's move on to some history. The dashiki in recent years has had a huge resurgence. You might have seen a lot of people wearing the dashiki for the Black Panther release. It's marketed as a streetwear piece. And companies like Dashiki Pride are coming out with new models of the dashiki on the daily. But let's talk about the history. You can trace the dashiki back to West African culture. In the 12th and 13th century, similar garments were found in Southern Mali burial grounds. Dashiki comes from the word Danshiki, and what a Danshiki or Dashiki is, is a loose-fitting pullover comfortable enough to work in heat. It first became popular during the Civil Rights Movement and the Black Panther Movement of the 60s and 70s. It was definitely a symbol of black pride. Black Americans were putting on something that was undeniably African to show that they were proud to be black. It was first mass-produced in 1967 by a company called New Breed LTE, out of Harlem, New York. The owner, Jason Benning, coined the term dashiki. The most popular dashiki you might see is the one I have on right now. But even though this is the African garment, the print that you see is actually of Dutch origin. When the Dutch colonized Indonesia, they took the wax printed style back to their country and started to mass produce this. But why is this important? Because this is more than just a loose fitting garment. It's a symbol of black pride. If you like the video, like, share, and subscribe. It helps me a lot. Comment below if any ideas or topics you want me to speak on. Black Universal.